Yo, what's the deal, peeps? What's the deal? So I haven't done a video in a while, and I just want to give you guys an update. So um, pretty much, I don't think I talked about some of this stuff. I think I'm not sure if I covered it or not. I'm going to try to do a quick little video, just give you guys an update, because I'm about to go out and fish with my homie and just chill. And like... So I wanted to like just give you guys a rundown because even though things aren't the best right now, like I can I can change them up if I wanted to. You know what I mean? But it just depends. Like I'm going to explain what I'm talking about right now. So let me see real quick. I want to make sure. Uh, I want to make sure that I have this right because I don't like my screen shutting off when I'm using it. All right, so so check this out, right? All right, so I just recently got a job, twenty two fifty an hour. Congratulations! Woo! So I've been working there, and you know it's a job. Obviously, it's it's good, but you guys already know what comes along with it, right? So first of all, I want to tell you guys this: that these perps have been trying to get close, but they don't know how because I'm too smart and they notice everything, right? So when I had to go from my physical, I, I think I talked about this in a different video, but I haven't uploaded it yet. They um everything was cool. Everything in the physical was was cool. Like I didn't mind doing it. They just want to make sure that you're healthy for the job. The only problem that I had was that they did x-rays on my lungs because they wanted to see to make sure that you, you know, you can breathe properly and stuff like that. But I'm pretty sure I could have probably refused the x-ray and just told them, like, you know, you guys can do whatever other tests, but I'm electrosensitive and I don't want to do that. So um, after I did that x-ray, like, they did two x-rays. The first one, there was like, oh, it was like, oh, it didn't work. And he was like, had me standing there with this fucking radiation fucking aiming at me, right? And so I was just like, dick, this motherfucker, like, in the back of my head, I was thinking, like, the vulnerable part, part in your body is the back of your neck. That's where, like, all these neuroreceptors are and shit. And it's like, I guess, a highway, like, for your spine and, like, the nerve the nerve endings and shit information to travel. And I, that's just my opinion. I'm not sure exactly how it works, but... I know for a fact that that's where a lot of energy is being focused on me through my targeting. So this area was exposed when when I went to go get this x-ray done, right? Let me see. Let me just try to type in some stuff so I can so I can see something, right? Hold on. So long x-ray. So this is what they did pretty much. They they took a fucking you know, a fucking scan of my shit, right? And I'm like, I'm not sure what other, like, I'm pretty sure there's, like, eco labs fucking connected to this. Like, government, they can purchase your records and shit like that. They can fucking see everything that you do. You know, not only that, but we're being followed and targeted at the same time, right? So, um, I'm pretty sure they, like, intercepted this information somehow or, like, were focusing some bullshit while they were doing this fucking thing on me. I don't know. But anyways, after I left that place, I, I wasn't thinking anything of it. But then, like, I had this helicopter following me the whole way home. And these motherfuckers are sneaky, bro. Like, they don't just, like, try to do shit out and about. They don't want you to figure out what they're doing. But I'm going to explain to you guys. Watch. Look, I'm going to explain to you guys pieces by pieces that I started to notice. And I'm starting to take precaution because I don't want I don't want there to be any vulnerabilities in, in my life with them because right now my targeting it's like whatever you know what i mean like it's not nothing i can't handle these bitches yeah whatever they can fucking read my fucking thoughts and shit like that like like when i'm standing up or like they can hit my heart a little bit but and they can fucking follow me around more accurately i don't give a fuck about that shit that shit's nothing to me like i'm already like dude i'm making money I'm like, I'm in a good place with myself right now. And I'm just like, dick, these fools are going to like, I could fuck them up if I want to. But see, the thing is, is that I have, I keep having, um, 
I guess like these kinks and my shielding that I'm trying to fix. I don't want to go and fuck them up and then have them just regain back connection again. Like I want to fuck them up permanently. So I'm trying to like, I'm going to try to attack all at once and just fucking boom, just shut them down, like sick with it. So I'm going to strike when I'm ready. Like right now I'm just like, I'm allowing these little bitches to be fucking lingering on my nuts, but trust and believe bro. Like just watch, just listen to what I'm telling you. All right. Look, so right now, I don't know if you guys can hear the ACs on and I'm like, I have one earplug on and usually like I use two different types of earplugs because it helps and they have to like send different types of energy to get past two different types of earplugs. So I have one off and I can hear the AC. They're doing something to the AC because it didn't sound like that before. So like they're focusing energy or pumping through the electrical grid let me see. Uh, air conditioner, air conditioner, EMF. So, absolutely emit EMF radiation, and some even emit fairly large amounts. All right. So look, you think they can use these fields, bro? It's just simple fucking like mathematic science, whatever. Or I mean, electromagnetic fields is probably a different spectrum of like you know, of like science or whatever, but it's like, like, you know, it's just, you can access it, bro. You can use these things. Like that's what they're using to fuck with us. It's usually sound energy. Like it's always some fucking weird shit. Right. So like you just got to use your head. It's just basic shit. Like, okay. Yeah. Whatever. They want to fuck with me. Who cares? A lot. As long as I know where it's coming from, it doesn't really bother me. Like right now it's kind of loud and it's obnoxious, but, like, is it killing me? Am I being murdered? Am I falling to my knees in agony? Like, no, it's just some fucking purpose sound that they're pumping through my fucking air conditioner. Like, fuck them. Like, you know what I mean? Like, they're stupid as fuck, bro. Like, they're pathetic. Like, they, like the where they want to be, it's, like, not even ever going to be there. Like, the shit that they're doing is, like, fucking minuscule, lingering around me when I get up. When I turn off the air conditioner, they pass with a loud car. Like, it's just stupid little fucking small-time pathetic fucking pipsqueak shit. They should call this a fucking pipsqueak program because it's just nothing but fucking lame-ass fucking puppets that are doing these fuckers' biddings, bro. Like, look, look, hear me out real quick. Hear me out, all right? So, they got a fucking x-ray done on me, which... Which, which loud a window of opportunity, a very short window of opportunity. So if you guys ever get a job, please do not let them take x-rays of you, okay? Or any other fucking x-rays. You don't need that shit, all right? Just don't do it. Avoid it. Fucking pass. Fucking exempt. Don't do it. I'm, I'm trying to inform you guys ahead of time for people that are trying to fight back. All right? So, <clears throat> so anyways... Um. So I started to notice my targeting kind of going up a little bit. And then, you know, I messed them up and then I mess up and I mess, I mess up again. Like, I don't know when to stop. Like I keep fucking up my shit and then I'll, I'll like, they'll get past it a little bit and then I'll get paranoid and I'll be like, fuck, I'm going to use this. Then I mess up the progress that I have because they've gotten good at like figuring it out and having me in a certain environment where they can control like my house. So like if I was out and I had my car and I was parking and parking wherever I want, it would be a lot harder for them because they have to start sending energy toward my way. And like it's just it's just harder for them. If you're in a house that they've already modified and have like brand new fucking systems around you, it's going to be easier for them to target you. Now they can't bring those systems toward you. They, they have to try, but it's going to be hard to triangulate you and stuff like that. So anyways, it just makes it more difficult for them. And what's it called? Um, so, okay. So like, okay. So I'm pretty much like over that part. I'm like, all right, whatever. Like these cowards, you know, they're like, they're desperate, bro. Like, so I was just like, all right, let me see. I just keep my eyes open and like, see what's up. Right. So um, I'm, I'm going to start this job. And so I go on the first day and it's orientation or whatever. And it's like a long process. We have to watch these video signs, a bunch of papers and like, you know what I mean? Like, just like get the rundown of how things work. And so that that goes pretty good. Then um, on the first day of, of the job, um, it's chill. It's like it's chill at first. And then um, and then I start noticing little things like they're 
their fucking they weren't they weren't like really showing their face yet or their hand but then little by little they started like synchronizing with me like if they were like waiting for themselves to be updated or it's it's the in my opinion it's like okay like if there's somebody in a beehive right they recognize each other they recognize that they're you know they're kind of on the same frequency so that the government since they're fucking with us and they're trying to put us on a different frequency it's like they don't recognize it and they want to attack so like i don't know what the government feeds all of these people but um let me see uh So, like, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know what the fuck they feed all these fucking squinkle-ass people, bro. But they, they must they must feed them some type of, like, information. I don't know. I don't know what it is. I would like to know, like, what is the spiel that they, like, that makes all of these people go against you? Because, like, I literally noticed kind of, like, somewhat normalcy in the beginning of the first day. And then after that, like everybody's fucking trying to like perp on me bro like it's crazy like it's like they're waiting and like acting and shit they're waiting to like fucking like oh and and they're all like cool with everyone else and then but like except for me like they're not saying what's up like they're just like oh like like if i give a fuck you know what i mean like i don't give a fuck i don't want to be accepted i don't want to be your fucking friend like i want to i like i like people that are chill like me and like and they're fucking they can be themselves like i don't need to like prove myself or like or whatever, you know what I mean? Like, I don't need to, um, like, show off like these clowns. So, you know, like these, you know, it's just, it's like little children, bro. They're like little children. They're trying to show off and, like, think that they're special and shit. And it's funny because, like, I, and then not not only that, but I was noticing, bro, like, I, I work with a lot of material, right? Cause it's a food, like a food kind of factory. So I'm, I'm working with a lot of powders and we mix these powders to make the food. So, um, these powders, they have a lab inside the place where I'm working and they always are telling you to like wash your hands and stuff like that. And, and what I, what I've noticed and what I've seen before on different occasions is there's this, these companies it's called eco labs or something like that, Ecolabs, and all this soap is being regulated. Um, S E P P A hand soap. All right, so all this all this stuff is being regulated, right? And hold on, I want to see uh, like all these soaps that 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 like Jobs have though. It's not these. The jobs have like all this other different types of soaps at their at their place, right? So I was thinking, well, like, okay, first of all, when you wash your hands in hot water, there's a bunch of fluoride in it and other shit in the fucking water, right? So you once you put your hand in that hot water and all these chemicals that you're working with or, or powders that you're working with, you put your hands in the hot water, that stuff automatically absorbs into your body. All right. So like I started to notice that my my targeting was going up very fast and very, very quick, like when I was working with these materials and I was just like, well, you know, it is like the food that we eat. Like this is probably being put in everything. Like this is probably how we're being targeted in the first place. And so I was just like, fuck, I got I, these, these gloves that they gave me are like, they're seeping through and, and like, just to be precautious, I don't know exactly if this is the way that they're doing it, but I need to be precautious. So I'm not using the soap because I don't trust Ecolabs. I've seen them following me a few times and, and they're like a laboratory testing. So they're, they're trying to figure out what the fuck you know, makes your body tick and what they can get into your system, you know, without really anybody detecting it. So, you know, it's like, it's like bi biology. And so 
you know, I'm a smart motherfucker and like I know that these motherfuckers like to be slick, but I'm fucking seeing their shit and I'm just like, why is it that like I'm kind of like catching on like to something that they're trying to do here? So I already fucking ordered some gloves. I ordered some fucking masks, some better filtration masks. I would really have like even like a fucking really, really good mask that you know that i can buy but i don't like i'll be like the only one wearing it out of everybody you know what i mean like if i care though but i I wouldn't i wouldn't care it's just that i don't know if they would be okay with it so like i would have to go to my supervisor and tell them you know what like i'm having allergic reaction like i'm getting really stuffy and my hands are getting irritated so i'm gonna have to put like buy these fucking materials like even though they don't come from the company because they're all like oh you could only use stuff that's coming from the company supposedly so like the earplugs whatever because there's always heavy machinery going on at my job so i'm just like like okay well now i'm gonna have to ask them like i mean i don't see the reason why i can't wear my own gloves like it's not fucking you know what i mean like i don't know it's just not a big deal to me i don't see it why i can't wear my own masks or gloves like it has to be the companies not only that the company they have these really cheap masks like that they have at doctor's offices or whatever and the fibers in the mask come off when you're breathing so like the longer you use them all those blue little fibers which could be more gallons or some other bullshit that they're putting in the fucking actual material you don't want to be breathing in that shit like these motherfuckers are they're these motherfuckers work with microbiology this is why you gotta be careful all right because it's it's very intricate all right it goes down to like the fucking shit that makes our body tick and 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 that can connect and fucking live stream and fucking synchronize with these little fucking puppets it's just little fucking parasites these fucking parasites that are around us that we don't know and this is just you know you don't gotta be all like cautious and stuff like that because it's everywhere i mean they're spraying in the fucking skies they're putting it in the foods so it's like but you don't want that shit like breathing it in and like getting a fucking straight dose of it, you know what I mean? Or absorbing it through your skin. You know what I mean? Like our body filtrates that stuff. But when you absorb stuff through your skin, I think it's more toxic than it is when you digest it. Because when you digest something, it goes through these filters of systems that you have in your stomach. When you absorb it into your skin, it goes through your bloodstream. So it's a little bit different, but it's just, I mean, it's just, you got to, you know, weigh out your options. All right. So anyways, these are some things that I noticed. All right. And so like right now they think that they're all in control and that I'm going to fucking slip up and shit. And I'm just like, they, like these fools that have no idea, like that I'm just going to fucking like their cheeks are going to get clapped. Like. Uh, just one day like right now if i wanted to do it i can go literally right now and do what the fuck i have planned but i'm not going to do it i'm gonna just let them like kind of like bask in their little fucking five seconds of glory and which isn't really much i mean oh my god they're a little bit more in tune with me it's like nothing major bro it's stupid as fuck so like the see the thing is if you don't know what you're doing because like i haven't been having too much success because i've been keep using the same materials that i use so if I use something new, it's going to fucking throw them off. But like, am I getting rid of the fungus? Am I getting rid of the, 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 the root of the problem? You know what I mean? Like, so I can't keep going and fucking using this stuff and then keep them having being able to gain regain control. So right now is what I'm noticing is that when I'm trying to fight back, I, I I'll end up eventually end up messing up and then they'll regain control. And then it's harder to get back to that position that i was in and it's been getting harder every time because these motherfuckers these eco lab pieces of shit if you guys don't know about them all right and there's probably different ones in fucking different neighborhoods or different fucking you know cities or fucking states they have their own little fucking eco lab bullshit or their own different types of uh companies that are fucking involved in doing this perp shit so oh a matter of fact too after i got scanned uh the next day 
I caught a fucking highway patrol parked outside of my house. And he was just sitting there in a red zone right at the corner of my house. And I went to go inside to grab my camera. I came back out. He left. Like, there's just, like, signs that are showing me, like, that they're trying to get close to me and shit. Or, like, they're trying so hard, like, at my job. Like, everybody's participating. And, like, I'm just, like, damn. I'm just laughing in the back of my head. I'm just, like, what make, what like what makes, like, what's driving them to, like, want to, like, because, okay, like, if somebody was giving you bad energy, right? Like, every time I looked at you, you can sense me looking, right? Because that's what's happening at my job. and And so instead of them, like like wondering why that's happening. Like, why do I feel this? Why is this happening? They're like touching their face or like going along with it and making it like a joke or like making it like a game. So like whatever they're being fed is like, Oh, I'm the bad one. Like I have like a curse or something or, or I have like, uh, like I'm marked as like a, like a fucking person that should be fucked with. Like, but who's telling them to do it, though? Is it, like, supposedly, like, a gang type of thing? Or is it, like, actually, do they know that this is being done by the government? Like, I don't think these motherfuckers know who they're actually getting orders from. I think they're, like, passing it down the pipeline and making it, like, look good. And so that, like, other people don't really know what's going on. They just they just think, like, oh, go along with it because everybody else is. I think I think they're like kind of like trying to make it look like good for them to do it like for some reason like whether it's about money or like whatever however they're trying to slander you like I I want to know what that is because it like kind of intrigues me like what are they telling these people like oh that this dude is a child molester or whatever whatever the fuck they're like feeding them like and then too like why don't they question it like, oh, since everybody else is doing it, like, oh, it must be true. You know what I mean? Like, it's just weird. Like, and then and then it was like a domino effect. I started seeing like one person like starting to do stupid shit, like pass by me, touch their face. And like, and they, they seen that I was paying attention. Like then more people started doing it. And then like little by little, they would all come out like in different times, like, like coordinated, like in back of me, in front of me, popping down right here. I look over here, they pop out. I look over there, they pop out. Like, it's just like the stupid gang stalking on the street. Like it's not really nothing major. It's just like, dude, okay. Like what the fuck? Like, this shit's funny they're puppets like to me it's 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 adorable it's like it makes me laugh because it's just like it just goes to show me like and then i'll just mess around like i'll be like you know what i mean like i'll shake my head or do like spins and circles but like mentally you know what i mean like just be like a fucking total maniac in my head like just like just doing weird like just weird like random stuff and like they kind of get thrown off or like I'll take one earplug out or like I'll open and close one of my earplugs and it'll be like doo, 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 doo. like the sound will like go in and out and stuff. And then they'll, they'll start being messed with. So like whatever I do to my body and then like sometimes I'll sing to myself or I'll hum to myself. And since I'm wearing earplugs within a job that's allowed, it's it's surrounded by machines. You can't hear me humming. So I'll be like, ooh. You know what I mean? And I'll do these sounds and it'll fuck with them. And I'm just like, okay, whenever I take my my mind state out of like focusing on them and I do something else, it's different for them. So like they're trying to wait for that signal of me looking or trying to pay attention to them. And then they start popping out of the woodworks. Even if I look down at the floor, it's me intentionally looking down at the floor, but it's kind of similar to me looking left or right. So like, let's just say I wanted to look at the, f at, I wanted to look right, but instead of looking right, I'll look down at the floor and somebody will still pop out. So like, they're trying to like coordinate like my brain thoughts with them, like trying to, to, to um, like street theater me on the job. So like I was testing it. So I would look down and then I would see somebody pop up like kind of like in my view but like i couldn't really see them that much but i'm just like that doesn't really matter where i'm look they're just monitoring my fucking my brain patterns and they're fucking emitting them to like other people around me somehow and i'm just like what the fuck like these motherfuckers are they're fucking pathetic like you know and then like last night i had spent the night at some chick's house right and like every time I got up, a car would pass. I would hear it, and I'll just be like, "Dick, okay." Like, 
it doesn't matter. Like I can fuck your shit up if I wanted to. Like, but it's just funny. Like these these fuckers are literally they're waiting at a green light. I look outside the window. They're waiting at a green light. They seem. I guess they notice that I'm paying attention, and then they start taking off after like five seconds. I was just like, dude, like these motherfuckers are literally on clockwork day and night fucking lingering on your nuts, bro. When you wake up, like when you're asleep, they're fucking out there trying to fuck with you, like trying to fucking leave as soon as you get up out of your car. A fucking ambulance will come out as soon as you wake up. Like it's just like and it's and it's like not exactly. It's not like you wake up to a siren. You wake up, you get up, the car fucking is waiting like somewhere, the fuck in its driveway or something. As soon as you get up and you're like walking to your door, a car will fucking pass or an ambulance will fucking pass. So it's like coordinated. It's not it's not just like, oh, coincidentally, they're like, oh, so there's noises. There's going to be noises. Obviously, they're going to wake you up. No, you wake up first and it's like five, six, several seconds pass. And it's always in this routine. And then the fucking sirens will come on. It's like if they acknowledge that you're up. So anyways, I just wanted to tell you guys, like, don't even trip. Like, I'm going to fucking come out with some more footage. Like, and, uh, you know, perps don't like being recorded, especially these fucking fake ass wannabe gangster fucking fools. So, like, honestly, these motherfuckers at my job, bro, like, they're kind of testing me, but not really anything major, it's just, like, fuckery, like, stupid-ass fuckery shit, and, like, I'm gonna call them out on it eventually, but, like, right now, I'm just kind of, like, whatever, dude, like, I'm gonna let them fucking be in their little fucking fairy tale world, whatever the fuck they believe that is, and, like, pretend like they're right, or whatever they're doing to me is fucking, like, you know, whatever, like, I don't give a fuck, like, it doesn't really matter to me, but, um yeah i mean it's just it's a trip bro like how like the fucking extent that these motherfuckers go to just to fucking like try to keep us in fucking check and shit like or try to make like yeah it's just like it's like they're like anybody else like they start getting falling off or somebody in hollywood or whatever like they can Man, they can fucking, you know, they can like, I guess, do that to anybody that they want to. And they and they can fucking emit these certain energies and then like people will just fall along and obey and fucking like try to fuck with you. You know, so it doesn't really matter where you stay. But. Yeah. Um. Anyways, I'm getting sleepy. I just wanted to wrap that up. But like, dude, just be careful, dude. Like these motherfuckers are sinister. And I wouldn't trust them for shit, bro. Like, I'm taking precautions right now because I want to keep this job and I want to be able to get out of this situation. Like, I want to get my fucking van and shit like that. And, like, you know, so um, so that I could fucking have more opportunity to be, like, on my own and, like, not have these fucking pieces of trash fucking hanging on my nuts all the time. So, um I'm going to go freaking handle my business and, uh, and yeah, bro, these fools, dude, they're going to get taken out, like, just in no time soon, bro, like, and I'm going to have these fucking pussies, like, all fucking wound up so fucking tight, they're fucking not going to know whether to whine or take a shit. <laughs>